Hello everybody, I'm Natalia Bogani and I'm here at the Sofitel Hotel in Miami with the Casimiro Foundation celebrating its 10th anniversary gala. 10 years of hard work and dedication helping our next generation become global leaders and social entrepreneurs. The Casimiro Foundation is a non-profit organization engaged in entrepreneurial and philanthropic activities that reach out to youth. It has a mission to design and direct entrepreneurial programs that offer education, leadership, and social initiatives to mold and prepare youth with a sustainability strategy and social responsibility approach. The event featured a silent auction with outstanding items, a raffle, a beautiful tango show, and a live performance by Alicia Bruni y su grupo. Future events to look out for that will benefit the Casimiro Foundation are the annual toy drive, Expand the Innovators of Change Forum, the launch of the annual Youth Empowerment Symposium, and Under the Tent networking event. And I'm here with a beautiful Brenda Leguizamo. Brenda is part of the advisory board at the Casimiro Foundation. And Brenda, it's been so wonderful being here tonight. It's been so emotional and truly all the stories that I hear for all the students that have graduated from the programs. Tell me about uh, Passion Mindset. Passion Mindset was started last year with the focus of helping those who are unemployed because of the crisis to be able to focus on their passions and focus on their gifts and then we would help train them in entrepreneurial skills so they could start something of their own so they could become economically sustainable and the program was started by me and then I realized that it was something that could be aligned with the Casimiro Foundation, so it was approved by the Board of Advisors to be a part of the Casimiro Foundation because Casimiro Foundation has been helping so many youth throughout the years and some adults as well through some of the programs, so we figured this is a good fit. And now we are focused on launching in 2012 the first program for Passion Mindset to help entrepreneurs. How long has Passion Mindset been on board with Casimiro Foundation? It has been on board for a few months now, so we're in development of creating the programs and creating the funding with the funds raised so that we can be able to make this happen and provide the training for people. And I'm here with Alexis Perez. She's actually one of the students who was able to graduate from one of the programs with the Casimir Foundation. Alexis, do you want to tell us how your program went and how do you feel about it now that you've completed it and you're a young entrepreneur? Well, I feel great. I mean, this is a wonderful experience. I learned a lot and I've become a better person because of it. Uh, Juan Casimiro and the Casimiro Foundation has sponsored me through all my workshops and has made me go to all these wonderful events. It's really made me a better person. And I'm here with the man of the hour, Mr. Juan Casimiro. Juan, it's been such an honor to be here tonight with you. Thank you so much for having me. And you're celebrating 10 wonderful years of hard work and dedication. Tell me, how do you feel tonight? I feel fantastic. It's been a long road, but a very fun one as well. So there's two very special things that take place tonight. 10th anniversary of the Casimiro Foundation and my 10th anniversary of my lovely wife, Belgica. Congratulations. Thank you so much. And it's been a great road. I mean, I started something very humble that has taken on so many different twists and turns and has become a huge monster benefiting children from around the world. So long as kids are happy and we train them, I'm extremely happy and pleased with that. And now tell me, you have several programs going on here at the Casimiro Foundation. Do you want to share with me some of the programs that you have? Yeah, we first started out with book scholarships and college scholarships. Then we discontinued that because of the cost and so on, the management of that. Today we have the Youth Chamber of Commerce, which focuses on leadership, uh, philanthropy, and career readiness for young people. Carla, my stepdaughter, was the first secretary when she was about 10 years old, 12 years old with that, making phone calls and so on. And then we also have uh, the Passion Mindset, which is one of our board members' idea, uh, Brenda, who thought about creating something for the unemployed, those who have lost their jobs, particularly women that are seeking jobs and so on. So Passion Mindset does workshops for them. In addition to that, we have the Globe Exchange Internship. There's an internship that brings young people from around the world. So far, we've had about 12 over the last five years, and they've come from South America. We've had a student come in from England, so therefore Europe, Caribbean, and so on. And then you have one of my favorite programs, which is SEED, which is a program which is called C S E E D. It's Self uh, Enterprises and Entrepreneurship Development Capital Fund. So it's a fund for micro business owners, people who just need a hundred dollars 
maybe it's fifty dollars or three hundred or a thousand and we fund their ventures with the agreement that when they start their business they also help back the community from those uh, businesses that they started I've carried this uh, organization for 10 years a lot of it out of self-motivation uh, my personal bank account and trying to make things happen one way or another. It, it, it could no longer go to the next decade and grow as an entity without that support financially and also people skills and, and people that get involved in growing it, the rich spirit. And uh, I'll tell you, Avnet, uh, Willis, AXA, and all the corporations such as Hellman that have made it possible, the media that makes it possible, your involvement, we just met and one day later you said, I'm in. That's what the spirit is about, you know, helping me and others to help others, paying it forward.